It's either you or the orphanage. Okay, the jury's gone. Can you please tell me who you really are? Without all those outlandish claims? But it's true! I'm Susie. I come from outer space. I'm a super genius. Oh, really? Well, what planet are you from? I told you a million times. Earth, of course. Earth? <laughs> Look at yourself. How can you identify as a space alien if you can't even get the planet right? Space aliens? <laughs> aliens don't exist, silly. I'm a super genius who figured out how to go to space. You know, with science and stuff. <sighs> Gee, I'm utterly convinced. Say, what if I told you that I'm King Charles II, except I'm working at a post office, because that's what royal people do. I'll cook you some food when we get home. Get ready for tomorrow. 5 a.m. sharp, you hear? Yes, sir. <laughs> Come on, kid. It's nearly time for your first job. Five more minutes, please. Oi, Charlie. Who's that new kid? Oh, her? Uh, she's Susie. I'm her guardian. It's a long story. You have adopted that Amy? Why? She looks really troublesome. Well, I mean, she doesn't have any parents. You know, poor kid needs a good up. Uh, Charlie? You sure you can do that? Not that I'm down you, but actually, scratch that. I'm really down you right now. Well, I don't know if anyone else would take care of her. Someone responsible. Look at her. She's too, what's the word? Energetic? King Charles! King Charles II! Stop that! It's getting old. You're going too slow. We're going to be here all day. I can take my time if I want to. Stop that! Susie, what are you doing? I thought that kind of music might make you go faster. Like hell it does. Give me that. No, it's got too many government secrets on that. Super geniuses only. Don't make me use my neuralizer on you. And can you quit it with the super genius rubbish? No, you're not the special snowflake you think you are. I'm not special? No. Act like a normal kid and wear normal clothing. Also, stop applying all that glitter to yourself. It's getting everywhere. I... I don't wear glitter. I just ate some radioactive substances on a nearby planet. That, that's why I glow. And for crying out loud, stop talking about bloody space! Okay, okay, I'm sorry. Oh, please don't cry. It's... It's not the end of the world. Um, oh, why don't I tell you about a new science word? I've got many of those. You, the science word? Yeah. Hey, do you know quantum chronodynamics? Isn't that the theory about the strong interaction between quarks and gluons? Oh. You actually do know your stuff. Okay, how about this? If this is too boring for you, would you like to try delivering the mail for me? Hmm, still looks boring. Think of it this way. The mail is a spaceship, and your mission is to duck it into the space station. Oh, that's cool. There's no sound in space. Let's get to the next stop, then. Yay!
El boy, 5 a.m. <sighs> okay. Are you ready to rumble? Yes, sir. <laughs> Nice parenting, Charlie. Ah, she's just a kid. I'm sure you made a mistake before, Sarah. It was a mistake working here. Well, if you want job satisfaction, you should have picked a different line of work. You know, there's a lot of possibilities out there. Your optimism is making me feel sick. Well, joy is a tough pill to swallow. Charles, King Charles! Can we go super fast this time? I'll go get the spare helmet out back. Yay! Do you think I can deliver the mail on this speed? It wouldn't hurt to try!